I grew up an athlete my entire life. I played team sports specifically, and I graduated and I had like a midlife crisis at 21, and I was like, there's no more sport. What am I gonna do? And I purchased a triathlon bike, and I entered a full Ironman two weeks later, which is kind of nutty. And I just went for it at 21 years old, and I still have the, the thrill and the, and the bug of triathlon. So I learned about Master Spots. Let's take the pandemic out of it. I have always genuinely wanted one. I just didn't know where to drive that. And so I started really investigating in, in you all and everything, and I, I was fortunate enough to have, have my Master Spa delivered within three to four weeks, and I was swimming in it. The day I actually raced an Ironman VR competition, I was able to recover in, in that exact master spa after, which was life for me, just as someone who loves the water. So using the swim spa for a training aspect is much different than I anticipated. Surprisingly, I, I thought at first I would feel claustrophobic uh, swimming in place. I really did. I was like, how's this gonna work? It wasn't an issue. The jets are really uninvasive, so it kind of flows and your body just floats and you can swim and I could get the feel of the water again. And we got to do a virtual race in my own home on my trainer and treadmill and we got to swim in the master spa. So what's been great about having the master spa is being able to stroke count, being able to look at my stroke, being able to uh, work on the cadence of my stroke as well while watching myself, that's been huge. And that wasn't anticipated. I thought I was just gonna get in, do the work and then get out. But now I get in, I can do the work, but I can also um, make sure that I'm doing it the right way, which will essentially benefit me out in the open water. I'm a swimmer at heart, like the water is my sanctuary. Like, so I don't do yoga and, and I don't do meditation outside the water but in the water, that's when I do those things. Sure, I swim hard several times a week, but the other couple swims are my recovery swims, and I was missing that in the pandemic. And then, you know, you're running and biking so much, like your muscles are like angry or strength and everything's angry. You need to swim, you need your what we call MBK chi swims. So when this bad boy got delivered, namaste, I was back. And as much as I love swimming in this master spa and swim spa, it's amazing. But I like the recovery of it, <laughs> specifically the standing bubbles at my back. Uh, you know, I'm no spring chicken, so recovery is so important. And being able to float in the water and get the massage bubbles on my back is primo. If I'm not smart in my recovery, it's going to be a negative, Thing in my training and therefore in my racing. So it has to be a priority. And if I don't make it a priority, I'm not going to be successful. And in my job, you, you want to be successful at your job. And so I've learned how to do that and listen to my body. Train, recover, relax. We use the swim spa to relax every single night. Uh, after my husband works all day, I work all day. We go in every night and we just use the bubbles on our backs, we talk. Matt gets to swim in the current. We really use it for family bonding time. Just, just having that family bonding, that was unexpected. So I can get in here and I can swim my heart out for X amount of time. And then like 30 seconds later, my son and my husband can, not or whilst I'm doing it, which is even more amazing, we'll turn up the heat this winter when Ohio winter comes and we'll still continue our nightly routine. So we're in this pandemic. But one thing that's gonna stay consistent is our use of the Master Spa. We're gonna keep using it every night to recover. I'm gonna still get in a couple times a week to do my training and look at my form and technique and stroke count and all that good stuff. And then I'm gonna keep recovering in it daily. So that's why the Master Spa has been great for us, pandemic or not.